Hey guys, it's Paolo. So I am so excited because today I am going to be talking with the beautiful and talented Ryan Michelle Bethany. Now she's in BET's new series, First Wives Club, based on the hilarious and classic film, so we get the scoop on that. Of course, we're also going to get the scoop on her hunky and talented husband, Sterling K. Brown. See you guys with Ryan. Okay, okay, are you ready? I'm so ready. Hi! Hi! <laughs> okay, it is an honor to meet you, honestly. Oh, like, it just, you. it is, and I'm kind of a little bit nervous because your husband is here in the audience. Um, hi, Sterling. Um, okay. <laughs> I want to tell you, you know, we've seen BET send me the first four episodes, and it's, I'm not saying because you're you're here, but it's amazing. Oh, first really? Wife oh, Club. good. It's Phew. hilarious. It's so good. I literally wanted them to send me the rest of the series, but like, no, you gotta wait till September 19, and you can just BET Plus and go get the whole, the rest of the series. But it's so good, and you were phenomenal in it, Thank really. Thank you. How do you feel? Like, this is an exciting day for you today. Are you able to take it in? Like, what are you thinking? I think so. That means a lot to me, so you're thank welcome. you. Yeah. Like, it, it's it's good to know that it's it's well received you know mm. it's been we, we filmed in September we were done in December so it's been a long time coming it's been mm. like a year now yeah. you know since we started as a matter of fact I left two days after the Emmys last year to go to New York to start filming wow. so it really is full circle for me it's really you know and so it's just it's an amazing project to be a part of yeah. and I knew what we were doing but it really felt like we were doing it in a vacuum mm. you know so I now that, that. It's, it's out I'm like oh right yeah. like it's oh. so cool. Like, obviously, you play Ari, okay? That's portrayed, that's Diane Keaton's character, kind of. Very much um, so. It's the chemistry that you have with the other girls. I mean, I just, I mean, we couldn't stop laughing. <laughs> was it that much fun with Michelle yes. and Jill? Like, did you yes. guys, was, yeah? Oh, my God, yes. Like, I, like to the point where there are so many things I can't even tell you because they became inside jokes so yeah. fast. You know, like, yeah. when you try to explain inside yeah. jokes about, yeah. like, a really good friend circle yeah. to someone else, you're like, no, 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 no. Because what happened was, the lizard, and, but it wasn't the, li you know, it, I, it would be like that. Like, yeah. we became fast, fast friends really 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 fast oh my god michelle Bichot is like hilarious. Is hilarious i mean it was just so funny and we are amazing we are mm -hmm. beautiful <laughs> intelligent focused driven women why did i get to have all the fun you're right i'm tired of being the one to make all the sacrifices get off your ass we are going out Tonight. Okay, see, no, I don't own any clothes that don't double as pajamas, and I haven't shaved in like, when did we graduate? A long time. <laughs> that is exactly why Hazel Rochelle has her own personal glam squad. <gasps> what? Oh my God, I'm getting a makeover like on the Today Show? <laughs> You know, yeah. I was thinking, like, when you when you got the call that you got this thrill, like, what did you what were you feeling? Because this is a big thing for you. You have been working, you have been doing this, you've been living your dream. But to get this character Ari, you mm -hmm. know, is a big thing. So, what, how did, did when you got that call? Were you like, oh my gosh, I can't believe this? Like, yes, I mean. I, well, first of all, this is the first time in my career that it was actually sort of a, a conversation, you mm. know, an offer. I, mm. I don't want to say an offer because it wasn't quite like that, but definitely I didn't have to audition for it. I didn't have to fight. Yeah. You know, it's because sometimes in L.A. auditioning feels a little bit like the Hunger Games yeah, yeah, where, totally. you know, you're like, I don't want to stab you, <laughs> but they're making me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> or you're the one getting stabbed. Like, go, girl, go. You know? Like, so this was the first time that all of that didn't happen. Yeah. Thank God. Right. And I just, you know, there was a sense of like, wow, like they, Tracy really sees something in me mm. that she thinks I can do this. And that was the first time I had that experience, mm. you know, and I really was like, it was amazing to be able to live up to someone's expectations. Mm. You and know? you did it. Like, but oh, you, thank you. you did so good. When you think of the character of Annie in the movie, like you see Ari more as like the boss. Like she takes control. Because I mm -hmm. feel like in the movie Annie, she was like insecure and she was getting nervous a lot. But mm -hmm. you really own that character. Like we felt it and we saw that. How did you prepare for it? Did you like tweet Diane Keaton, like, hey girl, like give me some, how did you do it? Or did you like watch the movie over and over? Did you rehearse with your husband? Like, how did you prepare for that? All of those things are hilarious and I <laughs> don't know why I didn't think of Did them Diana before. Did Diana tweet you back? Shame like, on could her. you imagine if that? I was like, hey, I've seen all your movies, girl. <laughs> can I? Can I tell you a secret yeah, that yeah, nobody please. knows? Yeah, nobody's gonna, gonna hear it. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. So I, um, I engage in alternative, alternative therapies, mm. i.e., psychics. <laughs> mm. okay. and 
I was going to the psychic and Goldie Hawn was walking out as I was. <laughs> no. Uh, I swear to God. And did you just do like a quick like. <laughs> well, like, it was one of those things where the door opened and there she was. And I was just like. Oh, You know when my... you hear music in your head and it was like. Yeah, 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 yeah. And like the lights on. And you're like, like oh my know? gosh. And all I could think of to say was like, congratulations <laughs> on your new granddaughter. <laughs> Like, it didn't even occur to me. You oh know? my gosh! Oh so my yeah, God. so that was my brush with the with the wise. Uh, the movie was is so much a part of our DNA because yeah, it's such an iconic film yeah. that you know everybody knows the lines and you know it was one of the few films that really was about female empowerment and sisterhood mm. and all of those things that we you know we looked up to for decades because it was the only one yeah. for so long. Yeah. You know, yeah. so I think for me and in, in preparing for it. You know, I just go to the script. No, I did not <laughs> work with that guy. Um, but there was there was so much to be mined from the relationship between those th those the three women yeah. that that was really the anchor that I just came wow. back to time and time and time and time again. You did it, show. like you really did. It's Thank so cool. You. Like as I sit here talking with you and I think about your career and like and you living your dream. When you are on the red carpet, you and your husband, are you able to take in and say like, oh my God, these people are here to like talk with us. They know our names or are you at this point like okay I'm used to it now no, or are you I, pinching yourself like, what does that feel I, like I never want to get used to it mm. I never want to forget that you know Sterling probably said it best the other day he was like you know we used to be sitting on the couch you know watching these shows wow. you know like I don't think I don't think such and such is gonna win oh my god a black person <laughs> won. you know what I mean like together on the couch like you know feet up like yeah and it, it you know you graduate from grad school and you're young and you think <laughs> you think any day now, right? Yeah. And then you think, okay, they say it's a marathon, not a sprint. Give me three years <laughs> coming at you. And then three years passes and you're like, but if I turn 30, <laughs> no one's going to think of me, you know? And then like you, you, then you're like, well, I'm just grateful to have a job. Yeah. And then when this happens, I don't ever want it to get old. Yeah. I don't ever want, you know, the, the, it's a privilege and an honor to go in people's homes. It's a privilege and honor for people to mm. know our names and for them to want to talk to us and for them to listen to us. Yeah. And I respect that and I'm deeply, deeply grateful at mm. all times. Oh so yeah. And you guys never get old because you guys always look so fierce. Look at this. I have all their pictures over here. <laughs> I mean, oh, that's what I mean. Like you guys are always like, I can see why you guys are love goals. Yes. I mean, look, a couple of those, look at this. I mean, oh, amazing, gorgeous. Melissa Massey, Melissa yes, Massey. Yes. What up, yes. Mark Allen? Yeah, we Just got. Just on yeah. point. Look at yeah. this. Uh, Seems. Ooh, it's... my legs look good there. Who took that picture? <laughs> <laughs> they look really good. It's pretty I'm amazing. Like you know, I think about your relationship with Sterling. You guys, you guys were born in the same hospital in St. Louis. Oh my God. You guys were yes. married I think June of 2007. You have two beautiful sons. Yeah. I mean, obviously, you guys are doing something that's right and it's inspiring for everyone else who's watching. Um, when you think about your character Ari, what relationship? advice would you give her knowing what you know now and everything you've been through? What would you tell her, you know, some relationship advice? Uh, well, before I get to that fun fact, mm. the flashback scene with the wedding, mm. it was mm -hmm. my actual wedding dress. Wow. Yeah. Oh my God, so nice. Yeah, uh, it was actually sweet. Um, mm. I felt really, I was like, oh, my wedding dress. They say wow. you can never wear it again, but I did. <laughs> Yay. Got my money's worth. Yeah. Um, oh. So, <laughs> I think, I think I would say, you know, Ari has to, and Sterling would say I do this a little bit too much, but I would say she has to be really honest with her husband, you mm. know what I mean? And sometimes it's okay to argue. Mm. Sometimes it's okay to show your husband your exact level of frustration so that mm. they really understand just how frustrated you are and just and not and in not a way hide anything and not hide inside, anything yeah. because when you hide the bad you also hide the good Ooh. when that person is not the person you go to for everything oh. then you find your joy elsewhere your mm. joy and, and that doesn't necessarily mean other people but it can mean your friends it could mean your work it could yeah. mean just driving in the car alone and when you find yourself getting to the point where your happiest moments are always away from your spouse mm then that's a problem. And I think that you need to have that balance with your spouse where they need to see like, no, I'm really upset. No, it, I'm really happy. You it's know? the communication that it's works. The and communication. that's what we all need to make is to communicate. It's like really amazing. You know, 
I like to say hashtag love goals. Uh, you guys are amazing. So we have a little something for you, okay? Because we can't. Love goals because too. We are love goals. Husband, did you hear that? Patrick you and totally I are love goals. Are. Oh my God, thank He's you. Like the sweetest. You're so, so cute. So we got a little something for you because today's a special day. No, you didn't. Yes, we did. <laughs> so this is a little something for you to congratulate you on a day because you have to remember September 19. Like it's a big day that everyone is going to be streaming the show on BET Plus. There's mm -hmm. nine episodes, mm -hmm. and I'm telling you, I'm not saying just because she's here. It's just each episode is so funny. It's so good. The acting is brilliant. Aww. And it's just, it's the truth. It is the truth. So I am so proud Thank of you. you. Thank you. Now open your little that blue means, box. Oh my God. Because they're all wondering. They're all like, what, what's in there? You know, what's I usually there? take these things home and open them in private oh, so see, nobody okay. knows. No, because I'm not like, going to be writing on Don't be too. looking at myself. But look, you guys, it's a little blue box. Okay, you guys just have to know that I'm super bougie. And like, oh. this is like my happy place. Oh. I'm like, blue boxes. Oh blue boxes. Take it in. Oh, oh, and another little blue box. <laughs> I'm just so happy with all of this. A little this. something. You guys, no way. Heart love, because it's all love, your love. The show is love, you and your husband are love. And if we have more love in the world, it's a better place. Yeah. Oh, thank you, pal. This is really, really sweet. Oh thank my you. God, you are so welcome. I am so proud oh, of you. Oh, this is just really <laughs> thoughtful. You're welcome. Here, help me with it on. Of course. Of you would think you're proposing to me. I'm oh my like, god. Sterling, I'm not. I'm Sterling, sorry, I swear to god. But no, no, this is no, really no, thoughtful. No, no, I'm not. I'm not. You're welcome. Oh my god. You guys came all the way from Chicago, my favorite yeah, there city. You go. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna treasure this. Hey, listen. Tell me. If I come to Chicago, can we like hang out? We can out? have dinner, you can hang we can you guys come over, we you can have promise? a nice dinner, we'll pick a nice restaurant for sure. Yeah. Okay, oh, all right. You're the best. Mm. Much, you're the best. <laughs> much love to you, you. I'm Thank so you. proud of you. So stop what you're doing. Go to BT yes. Plus. Watch the nine episodes. You are you're going to love, love it. it. Yeah. <laughs> thank you so much, Ryan. Thank much love you. to you. Thank you, You Paolo. guys, thank you. Give us a thumbs up. And we'll see you next time at Spoonful of Apollo. Bye. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. This is just really, really cool. You love them. Don't lose your blue box. I'm not going to lose my blue box. Don't you better believe I'm not going to yeah, lose yeah. your blue box.